Pinarbashi in the mountains of southwest Turkey awakes to a new day and Friday morning prayers. Ahmed Muzin Tuzer is the local imam. His voice has won him a number of accolades for reciting scripture from the Quran. Just a few hours later, he's back on the mic in the tourist town of Kash, except this time belting out some serious rock music at a bar. Ahmed Tuzer is the frontman of Firak. The band's music combines rock with lyrics that draw heavily on the Sufi tradition, the mystical branch of Islam. Tuzer himself sees no conflict in being an imam and a rock singer. It depends what you want to say when you're playing guitar. Our aim is to encourage devotion to God. We want our music to guide people to the right path. Firak have only been together for three months, but their debut album is already close to completion. Religious rock, the birth of a new genre in Turkey? God should give every community an imam like him. Imam Ahmet is a good friend, a really open person, and he understands a lot about rock music. Turkey needs more imams like him. Ahmed Tuzer grew up on the Turkish Riviera, a part of the country where religious practices are more liberal than elsewhere in the country. Imams here can lead a modern lifestyle. Tuzer's superiors, the state religious authorities, have so far expressed no concerns about their imam's alternative career. For their first video, Firak performed against the backdrop of the famous Blue Mosque in Istanbul. Tuzer's father did have difficulty with his son's musical ambitions. It would have been unimaginable in his day when he was the imam. I was initially against it. I told him this kind of music isn't compatible with our profession. Imams are supposed to be role models. But fortunately, he explained his intentions on television. That helped to reassure his critics. The rocking imam is now something of a nationwide celebrity, although in his native village, locals take all the hype with a pinch of salt. Of course we're proud when he's on TV or in the newspaper. He's our imam. Tuza has courted controversy before, when he married a Christian woman from Romania. Now the self-professed Freddie Mercury fan wants to use his popularity to promote a more modern version of Islam. Muslims should stop trying to live by Sharia law. It means they miss the goal of a genuinely free faith. Change in Islam is long overdue. I hope our music can help the faith evolve. Later, in his more familiar role, Tuzer issues the call to evening prayers. It's currently Ramadan. After sundown, he breaks his daily fast together with the rest of the village. Here on the main square, it isn't difficult to find fans of Firak. It's possible here because Turkey is more tolerant than other Muslim countries. That's why we get on fine with the idea of the band. The potential market for Firak's Islam-inspired music is a global one. Their brand of religious rock could land them a lucrative major label deal. The rocking imam certainly seems destined for bigger stages than the mosque of his tranquil home village. <laughs>